Hi, this is Don Campbell with Expand to Web. And I'd like to show you a, a neat little thing that I just kind of worked out. I've had a lot of people for that use my Expand to Web Small Biz WordPress theme want to take the homepage and add a video to it. And instead of trying to jam a video in here and replacing the image, the best way to do it is to just create a new page in WordPress. And then we'll drop a video in there. I'll show you exactly how to do that. So first is first thing we're going to do is log into WordPress and then go to pages and we're going to create a new page notice we're not doing a post we're doing a page we're going to going to create a new page in WordPress that's going to replace our home page so I'm going to go ahead and say um, call, I'll call it welcome welcome to our business or whatever we want to do and create this page as um, we're going to have to go into the HTML mode here because we're need, going to need to do a couple of things um, that you know aren't, they're not too bad. What we need to do is go to YouTube, get our video embed code. So I'm going to go to YouTube, grab a video, and what I'm going to do is probably change the size of it. So you can you can select down here and change what size. You can pretty much put any size you want, but I want to wrap some text around it. So I'm going to go with this 425 width video. Grab the embed code. And I'm going to go back to WordPress and notice again that I'm in the HTML editor mode. I'm going to just put that embed code right in there. Okay. But what you need to do though is we need to add just a little bit of um, styling to this before. And you're going to see what I'm doing here. I'm adding this text right here. It's um, I'm creating a div and I'm saying I want it to float left and I'm giving it a little bit of margin stuff. And then I'm going to close the div. So let me kind of break this up for you just so you can see what I'm doing. So all this code right here is the stuff I just got from YouTube, right? And all we're doing is adding a div around it that gives it a couple of their style sheet, you know, kind of things to say, hey, I want text to wrap around it. I want this to float left, put a little margin around it, and that's it. Then I'm going to just grab some text to drop in here just as an example so you can see how the text wraps and everything like that. So this is just a little bit of basic HTML code, the same stuff that's already on the home page right now essentially. And then what I'm going to do is, is preview it. And that's one of the really cool things about WordPress is you can just preview all this stuff and, and see how it's going to look. And, and here we go. Here's a, um, you know, we just added a video to the home page. And we can change the width. You know, we could have gotten a, a smaller video if we wanted. We can play it right, embedded in the home page, and then we can, um, you know, mess around with this text. Like for example, this is a little bit too big right here. We might wanna, might wanna make that a little smaller. This text right here. Maybe we say, um, take that down a little bit, and make it so it all fits on one line. And we can, so we can adjust and edit from here. But the idea is we can create this page. Now it's not our home page yet. But we're going to create this page and tweak it a little bit and get it just how we want it. So I'm going to take out these things. And here's what we're going to do. We're going to say we're going to publish the page. All right. And this actually creates it as a, as a legitimate page in WordPress. And then we're going to go to the small biz options panel under appearance. And we're going to say that we don't want that to show up in our navigation menu. And I'll show you why in just a second. But if you look down here under Omit Pages, you're going to see our new page. And I'm going to hold the Control key or the Command key down on the Mac, Control on the PC to multiple, you know, select multiple pages. I'm going to say, I don't want this to show up in my navigation menu. And then I'm going to save it. Okay? Because this is going to be my new home page, I don't want it showing up up here. You know, with its own name, I want it to show up just on the home page. So, okay, so now let's replace the home page with this cool new page we just created. What we're going to do is go into the WordPress settings on the left and go to the reading options. And here you're going to see this neat little area where you can say, I want to change, I want to display a different page on my front page. I'm going to select a static page. And from this drop down, I'm going to select my welcome page. Save my changes. Now, when I go back to my blog and I go to the home page, now you'll see the video, right? This is the new page we created with the video on it. And obviously I would work a little bit on the styling here, you know, to make it look nice, but you know, that's the idea. You can go in there now and, and edit that. And you can even, if you want to, if, if you wanted to go back to your 
um, to your page and edit it you can go back to visual mode now and it'll keep the um, the visual mode a little bit quirky with the embedded media in it but you it'll keep the video in it now the latest version of WordPress does a pretty good job with it so you can edit it either in HTML or visual mode but anyway that's how you do it and um, now you've got a, a new home page for your small biz theme that has a video on it with different sizes and everything like that so I hope this was helpful and leave me any questions in the comments below thanks